office is in Boynton Beach, Florida. My home is in Delray Beach, Florida. And right now we are about three days out from having a category four hurricane. And this is our headquarters. In 2005, when Hurricane Wilma hit, uh, the entire roof of our building peeled off. But we somehow got a temporary roof on and brought in generators and we were able to work and, and get back to work. It, uh, it was a huge undertaking, but it all came together. And now we've got a bigger storm bearing down on us. It's hard to uh, wish that it doesn't hit you and go somewhere else because that just means it's hitting somebody else. Um, so we're hoping it goes out to sea somehow. These are the preparations that are being made. Today is Thursday. We closed the company down. All the employees are here are just the people that wanted to show up and help out because uh, they were all prepared at home. We told everybody else, take today and prepare. Our warehouse has room for about 17 cars, so a lot of the people that work here are going to be putting their cars or spare cars in the warehouse to try to prevent a total loss of a vehicle. We've been doing this hurricane thing for a long time. So we have a phone list of all the employees. We're gonna do a pre-hurricane call, a post-hurricane call. We have another building that we own up the street that's hurricane safe, and we will open that as a shelter for anybody who's too afraid to stay at home tomorrow or the next day. Uh, I'm planning on staying at my house, and if the storm is gonna be over 150 or 60 miles an hour, then I will move to our, to our hurricane protected building. How is, how is the hurricane preparation going, guys? Good. Good, Charlie. So the high tide isn't for two more hours and it's going to come up another one foot, two inches. And but the boat will still be out of the water. So we've got the lift up as high as it can go. We've got dock lines tying the boat to the lift. We've got feeder vans coming in, although right now we do not anticipate a big storm. There's about a 75 percent probability, according to the weather that we'll get hurricane force winds tomorrow morning at 8 or 10 o'clock. Who wakes up next to you? No. When I go out, well, I know I'm going to be, I'm going to be Three the hurricane. man who goes along Get some you. energy out. Kids in the house all get day. Drunk. Well, I know I'm going to be, I'm going to be the man who gets drunk next to you. You ready to run? Let's go. Ready? If I have a... Yeah, I know I'm going to be, I'm going to be the man who's going to run to you. And I would walk 500 miles And I would walk 500 more Just to be the man who walks 1,000 miles to fall down that short door When I'm working Woo! Yes, I know I'm gonna be Break I'm gonna through! Be Woo! The National Hurricane Center, the 5 o'clock update It's still packing maximum sustained winds of 125 miles per hour That makes it a very strong Hey guys, what happened? We lost Daddy, power. Is the door locked out there, by the way? Yeah. So it's morning. The storm is just off of Key West. And the power is out. So we've had to empty all the refrigerators and start packing uh, all the perishables in the coolers. The brunt of the storm is going to be well west of us. So all we're gonna have really is a tropical storm today. So the storm is getting worse. It's just pulling into Key West. The feeder band that we just got was blowing uh, about 50 miles an hour. Oh wow, look at this. But the wind is blowing. How fast is that blowing right now? It's 30. Yeah, it's 30. Well, that's, uh, it's about 38 miles an hour. Now picture 100 miles an hour or 150. So right now, it's a consistent 44 knots. And I know it doesn't look like much because the intercoastal has just got little waves, but there's very little fetch across there. But they say that the worst part of the storm is between Naples and Fort Myers right now, and we're gonna have our highest wind on this side, about half of what they're getting. So the main part of the storm is on us right now. And we're getting 60 knot gusts. I don't know if you can see this, but it's like, it's like, and these are um, hurricane proof doors, and they're supposed to be good to 200 miles an hour. But I mean, we are getting the full brunt of this, uh, this feeder band right now. This is insane. Oh, look at the waves! Yeah, this is crazy. But I mean, it's a fishbowl. It's the best place to watch the storm you could have. Yeah, this is incredible. 
the boat, the, pool with the, wind the boat is fine. Yeah, the boat's fine. It's the end of a long day of storm sitting. Storm sitting. We still have no power, and the storm should be subsiding. It's morning on Monday, and the storm finished around 5 a.m. And we ended up having um, 79 mile an hour wind gusts in Delray Beach. And we've been working all morning cleaning up, putting furniture back. And pretty much it's just down trees and things like that everywhere. Not really any damage to the house. Thank you.